everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to get an image as a background on uh, OBS or maybe get like a solid color. So we can go to our scene. We want to go and edit. And then we can go to sources. We can go to the plus icon right here. And we have a couple different options. So if you go to like a color source right here and select this and go to create new color, we could do like a um, blue or something like that. We can make it a solid color. And then we can just select a color right here. Uh, let's go to one of these. Uh, let's go with that. And then we can have a blue background. And we can right click on this. And we can go to transform. And we can make this the entire screen now on here. So let's go to fit to screen. So maybe you have like a, a blue background or something you want. I don't know. Or maybe like a green. But to get like an image from your computer, we can go to the plus icon once again. Uh, we can go to image. Go to new image, uh, maybe make it like a beach background or something. If you went to Google Images and saved it. And the hard part is just locating it on your computer where you have it saved. So uh, it could be under uh, this PC somewhere. Uh, you download it from uh, the web browser or something like that. Could be under here. So I got some pictures of my bike. So let's add that in here. So here's my bike. I love this bike. Right click on this. This one I probably don't want to uh, stretch the screen. Let's go this one. See if it, yep. So I can have it like that. And we can go back to the plus icon, do an image slideshow. We can add multiple images in the background. And we have media sources. A media source, you can add videos or uh, like music. And I believe there is a browser one right here. I don't know if we could do this, but let's go to this and just do like a beach or something like that. And we can add a, uh, well, I already got that in there. Let's go to um, maybe Volcano, if I spelled that correctly. We can add a URL in here. So, I don't know, let's just go to Google.com real quick. I'm watching some volleyball on uh, my account here, Facebook. So, let's go over here and just type in, um, I don't know, Volcano. Maybe go to Images. See if we can get one of these. So we copy over like this direct path over here. And uh, let's go to the copy. Uh, let's see how do we do this. We can go to this image, um, share maybe. And there should be a URL right here. We can just try copying this over. I click on it. Go back over here. Let me see if this works. And paste it in here and go to OK. And well, I got the image in there. <laughs> what we could do, what we could do from here is adjust the width and the height of this so it cuts out the entire border. Otherwise, we can just go beyond this and just drag it so we don't really see it as much. If we really wanted to see like just the background like this, I think we could just go in here a little bit more. So if we go to the volcano, can we right click on this and go to properties? Uh, yes, we have the height and width right here. So maybe do like 700. Let's go ahead and mute that real quick. And we can adjust this to 700. Let's see if it cuts out the side and height. Let's maybe go like 400. Go to OK. Hmm, didn't do exactly what I thought would do. Um, so let's go ahead and just do 400 and 400. See if that changes anything. Now it's just going to change the height of the entire thing. So your best bet is really just to move it along just like this and just get as the background image. So hopefully this quick little video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your Six Tech.